the Alotau Township gathered to witness the official opening of their rehabilitated town market and fisheries facility yesterday. With its opening, subsistence farmers, small-scale fishermen, and residents of Alatau and nearby districts will greatly benefit, thus seeing a boost in production and service within the province and country. Hence, it's crucial to build such infrastructure to create an avenue to support subsistence farmers and fishermen generate economic income. The project was funded by the Japanese government through the JICA Overseas Development Assistance Grant with some funding from the PNG government through the National Fisheries Authority. The overall goal of the program is to add to the sustainable coastal fisheries development and management in the country. This market project sets the foundation for other markets in the future throughout PNG. I also now take this opportunity to stress the importance of coastal and inshore fisheries in PNG. While tuna and offshore fisheries remain vital to PNG because of the revenue it generates, coastal and inland fisheries support food security and livelihoods for many coastal, inland and highland communities. Alotau MP Charles Abel thanked the landowners for the land on which the facility lies for their cooperation in making the project a success. It is very important that the traditional landowners, wherever that place may be, wherever that town may be, and in this case our Huhu landowners, must always feel that they have a vested interest and a stake in the economic development of these urban areas in the town, where they were the original landowners. And we have stood by that principle. Prime Minister James Marape challenged the people of Mellon Bay to utilize the new facility well. The government that I lead believes in empowering provincial government and lower levels of government for them to interface closer with your people to ensure you get going in as far as participating in business, whether it is in fisheries business, marine businesses, or forestry business, or agriculture business, or even defining better local content in the mining and oil and gas business. We are pro empowering Papua New Guinea and sub-national government, as well as local clans and landowners. The market will be open for business on Monday. Lillian Sopera-Kinea, National MTV News.